Hey, what's up guys? Uh, welcome to my channel. This will be my first video of uh, many. Uh, just over some old school video game footage because, you know, the Call of Duty thing's kind of been done to death. And I want to uh, attract all types of people with my uh, stories because I'm just here to entertain, tell you my experiences with uh, certain things that happen. Uh, just, you know. So uh, sit back, relax, and uh, enjoy. So first off, I'm going to be telling you about uh, my experiences with this site called Meet Me. Because, oh boy, uh, I've had quite a few. Meet Me um, is basically like a local Facebook almost. Where you you only get, you don't have, you have, uh, you see the people that live, you know, within however many miles, like 100 miles. And it'll tell you when they post in the news feed. Uh, so, you know, someone might post a picture of themselves, uh, whatever. Uh, but you can show, <laughs> like, genitals on there, too. You can, it's not, it doesn't have as many rules as opposed to Facebook, so, you know. People take that very, uh, liberally. So, what, what about, um, what about, uh, Meet Me is that, you can ask questions, and you can make, you know, ask someone and they'll answer. You can make it anonymous or your name. Usually it's about sex and guys acting like perverts. And then, as much as I want to bash on the guys, uh, girls also are very uh, open and showy about certain things. And they have, like, zero self-respect. It's disgusting. But, um, so you can ask questions on there anonymously. And I went on there, and, you know, I... I, I got the gist it was like a dating site, but for teenagers, and teenagers don't have class, I guess. <laughs> um, so, I just kind of, you know, stuck around there. I, I posted up, like, goofy pictures. Like, I didn't even give two shits about what was going to be, you know. I, I didn't expect anyone, because I'm not, uh, I have no problem talking to girls. I can actually hold conversations fairly well, but uh, I'm also not the most attractive guy, so I don't get all the bitches. <laughs> but because you know on a dating site you have to give a profile or whatever and I cannot limit myself to text in a box if you want to get to know me you got to get to know me and two it's all about pictures because you know even I'm guilty of it if I go on there you see pictures and text that's how you have to judge someone um, you know you can't type that, talk to everyone on there so you have to be picky and that's unfortunately how it goes down but over the internet uh, people have they like they leave their uh, respect uh, at the door when they come on the internet and just start messaging the hot girls asking for certain things. So I got a message one day uh, anonymously saying like, "Hey, I want to cuddle with you," and all that horseshit. I was like, "Uh, yeah, this sounds like bullshit." Um. <laughs> who are you? See, you know, left it anonymously. So I'm thinking it's one of my friends, and we kept going back and forth for a little bit. And then I find out she's like, I am real. I'm like, all right. And then we started playing this, you know, guessing game. Um, I kind of knew who it was from the beginning because you can tell who last viewed your page and all that kind of stuff. But I didn't want to just blurt it out and embarrass the person. Um, so we went back and forth. I'm like, are, are you this? Yeah. Are, are you that? Yeah. Are, are you on my Facebook? Yeah. And by that point, I narrowed it down enough, and I pretty much told her. Uh, so then we started uh, kicking, uh, which is basically text messaging for, but you don't have to give out your number. It's actually fairly cool. Uh, so I went on there, and uh, we started kicking back and forth, and I was telling her, and I, was looking, I was like, all right, I'll, I'm looking for a relationship. And let me tell you, this girl was okay. Hey, she really wasn't my type of girl, because she's very, uh, almost ghetto. White, but, like, she, you know, the way she says, uh, nigga, uh, words like that, like, you, like, I could tell by her, you know, typings. Apparently I met her in my high school, uh, for, like, a minute. Like, we were, she came into one of my rooms, and I said, hey, buddy, no idea who the fuck it was. <laughs> and apparently that's how she remembered me. And so... I talked to her, and then I'm like, all right, well, you know, you want to call, you want to do all this, but 
I was like, all right, well, you know, are you looking for a relationship? But she's like, oh, uh, not, not really. You know, like basically blew me off. I was like, okay, what the hell were you trying to get out of me? <laughs> so that, that that really threw me off. I'm like, okay, this this site is very uh, this is not for me. And I see it around sometimes. I'm just so many problems. I see Facebook statuses. It just you know, I don't like meeting people over the internet. And another girl. Um, almost similar problem, just crazy, going back and forth between guys and shit, it's just like, uh, I can't deal with that shit, <laughs> I really can't, uh, other, th- you know, so that's, I kind of stay away from online dating sites, because, you know, the, the girls, as much as guys are fucking assholes, and have no problem saying, like, perverted shit on there, girls are crazy and almost encourage it most of the time. Um, either that or, you know, there's a reason why they're on there. Those, you know, pretty girls on a dating site, obviously something's going wrong there. Uh, you know, maybe a little, uh, mentally unstable. Uh, but that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed my first video. I'm gonna try and post a couple, uh, real quick. Just to get my, uh, YouTube, uh, you know, a couple of videos, uh, for you guys to listen to. And I want to start making them weekly. Uh, So I hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, as always, have a good day.